Unraveling the knot. Understanding, tie up loose ends. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase that often pops up in both casual conversations and professional settings. Tie up loose ends. It's a phrase that's as vivid and evocative as it is common, but what does it actually mean? Let's untangle this together and explore how you can use it to enhance your English fluency. At its core, tie up loose ends refers to the act of completing tasks or resolving issues that have been left unfinished or unresolved. Imagine a beautifully wrapped gift, but with several strands of ribbon hanging loose and untidy. Tying up these loose ends would mean neatening up, ensuring everything is in order and there are no loose threads. In life and work, it signifies finalizing the little details or sorting out remaining uncertainties to achieve a sense of completion. While the exact origin of tie up loose ends might be as tangled as the metaphorical knots it represents, the phrase likely draws from the nautical or textile worlds. In both these contexts, loose ends can lead to disarray or even danger. Thus, securing them is crucial for safety and tidiness. Over time, this literal action of securing loose ends has woven its way into our language as a metaphor for resolving unfinished business. To help you grasp how to use tie up loose ends in conversation, here are a few examples. In a professional context, before we launch the project, we need to tie up some loose ends regarding our marketing strategy. In personal tasks, I'm spending the weekend tying up loose ends around the house, like fixing that leaky faucet and clearing out the garage. In storytelling or movies, the final episode did a great job tying up all the loose ends, leaving no questions unanswered. Understanding and using phrases like, tie up loose ends, can significantly enhance your English communication. It's not just about vocabulary expansion, it's about enriching your language with the color and precision that idioms and phrases provide. They allow you to express complex ideas succinctly and vividly, making your conversation more engaging and relatable. We hope this exploration of tie up loose ends helps you feel more confident in weaving this phrase into your English conversations and writings. Idioms like this are threads in the rich tapestry of the English language, adding depth and color to our communications. Happy learning, and may you always find the right words to tie up your own loose ends. Remember, language learning is a journey. Enjoy the process, and see you in our next video.